let's schedule a nap. Here are my results. It is. <laughs> yep. Remember, everyone, that's definitely what happens when you nap. You get a strength up by 16 energy ups. You, you lose some charm, but you get that strength up. Get a Game Gear, the full color portable with over 150 games. You know what was popular beach volleyball games? And I think we better start it with something spicy. What do you think? And nothing's nothing's more spicy than a than a Japanese exclusive Popeye beach volleyball game. At least that's what I think. Oh, how about now? Oh, I'm moving much better. I realized what was happening. I was still broadcasting my VTuber out to Rippy. Uh, I wonder if this is a reskin. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, let's start with Popeye. Why not? Got a single player game and we got a bonus. Uh, I mean, start on the beach. Oh, we don't have many options. We have Olive and Wimpy. Gotta go with the Burger Man. Sure, he might be eating burgers. Oh, he used his belly. Is that allowed in beach volleyball? No! Wimpy, can you- can you work here? Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm not doing great, huh? Where's my spinach? <gasps> oh god! Like on cue somehow! Wait, I won? Wait, did getting the spinach earn me a point somehow? Yeah, that, that was very on cue. I, I don't know how to perceive... Oh. gonna just kick my ass. I don't think I'm winning this. This is pretty, uh... Oh! Oh, dang it!
Yeah, you know, waning interest, they tried to, you know, make the cast a Popeye as a rival team. I thought that was weird. Yeah, uh, maybe it's because they got that spinach branding. Wait, where am I? Wait. I was gonna say, that went out of bounds, so I'm okay. Yeah, that's the one thing I do like about the game here is, you know, it has a lot of nice colors. Serve! Oh. <laughs> we actually... maybe we'll... I lose. Game over. Sega. What is the bonus game? Bonus game fishing? Okay. Oh, is it, uh... Yeah, it's that flag game. Swift. These are, uh, weird go up bone escapes. No, oh, I, I didn't want that. Yeah, this has cute... Like, there are some animations in this also that are... Like, that opening animation was pretty good. Got a fish. I wouldn't say these are great mini games, but yeah. Uh... Let us go to one of the games that I have translated. This is a uh, very recent translation. Uh, where is it? For Saint Tail. Uh, Saint Tail was put out by Tokyo Pop. Got that voice. You know, it's... She's like a magical girl. Yeah, th that's what I mean. This is pretty recent. One, two. Yeah, look at her spin.
Yeah, that, I mean, Game Gear in general has a lot of Magical Girl on it. Sailor Moon, uh, Fray Earth. Uh, I guess story mode. A girl named Sorry has stopped by seeking our help. Her grandfather is a gemstone appraiser. One day, a jeweler brought ten gems in before to be appraised. The jeweler, Mr. Kaido, said five were valuable. The other five were imitations of the real gemstones. Fakes had been created to deter would-be thieves. Unfortunately, they were a bit too well-crafted. Yeah, but three. Mr. Cairo forgot which were the real stones. Therefore, he brought them all for appraisal. There are some miracles even God can't perform. <laughs> you hear that, folks? This being one of them. Well, Sayori is the one who came to talk with us. Her grandfather is the person seeking our help. What do you mean? Her grandfather became enchanted with their charm. And cool kids with... <laughs> yeah, I got the extra battery pack. All of a... Uh, on a sudden whim, he declared the forgeries real. And then he brought the real... B bought the real gems for peanuts as fakes. Well, that was an excellent con, now wasn't it? Everyone makes mistakes. However, those who who repent their sins are good souls. I think I'd like to try helping him this time. How so? Afterward, Mr. Kyo sold the copies. Five wealthy people purchased them as real jewels. So, what would you have us do now? What do you th think? Th what do you think might settle this peacefully? <laughs> Sega like battery. Well, did you happen to bring the real jewels? He. To, with her? How about I switch the real jewels for the fake ones? My thoughts exactly. The, the real jewels! Break into the various wealthy people's estates! <laughs> Swap the replicates with the authentic gemstones. This time... It's time for the mysterious thief... Saint Tail. It's time to magically transform again. One. Two. Three. And now I'm Saint Tail. As you as Saint Tail must sneak into five people's mansion. Once inside, you will switch the fake with the real ones. Each household's one minigame, swap for each game one. Getting caught by a security guard is a mistake. If you make a total of five mistakes, you lose and it's game over. Use magic cards. Now, so you. Okay. Oh, look at her.
Oops. I think I accidentally used my card and turned myself invisible. Oops. Snake, this is a sneaking wish. <laughs> Look at the guard! Good, I have like invincibility too. Will you win this time? I'm not gonna lose. Image slot complete and image turn points. Use slots to try to recompile. Okay. Saint tail, Saint tail. First mini game is slots. Hey, mom, dad zone. Yeah, we're game gearing. I'm sorry, slots is not a fun mini game. Oh, wait, I actually. Come on. I'm just gonna... Yeah, this is... This is a... A bad mini game to do your first... Show time. Okay, hopefully this next game is not gambling. Spot the difference.
Uh, okay, there's a star. Actually won. Yeah, I got the prize. I'll catch you. Keep pressing that by mistake. I mean, it's a cute animation. Oh man, I don't want to play. <laughs> Love the hedgehog. <laughs> Uh, so hey, uh, hey, Nex. Oh. oh. Okay, I was like, oh crap. At least the cards. <laughs> yeah, Saint Tail, famous for her uh, godly powers and CQC. Yeah, no, this is definitely not a... Uh... Pause. It just seems like something where you walk around and do a bunch of mini-games. Let me... S I don't want to do slots. I'm sorry. Start difference image select jewel drop fast magic. Well, what's polar? Escape the balloon, a game where Saint Tail avoids obstacles using a balloon. <laughs> well, I didn't do that. I did not, in fact, uh. Try that again. Oh God. <laughs> uh huh. Jewel, what's jewel dropped? Is this uh, bejeweled? What is this? Oh no, this is Tetris? Oh, columns. Okay. That makes sense. If you're on a Sega system, better do some columns. Sonic Labyrinth, really? Huh.
I know, that's weird. See, if this was a simple 2000s game, this would, or simple 1500, this would just be the thing by itself. Yeah, like, that's the thing. I think the sprite work in this area is pretty good. It's just doesn't seem to be that great of a game. But hey, I mean, if you really love Saint Tail, it's kind of the only option you're gonna get. <laughs> really? That I can count? Anyways. I like how Saint Tail... You know, she does some jumble jigsaw. What's Fashima? Oh, there is a Saint's tail. Uh, emulation on the Pico is not great. You need a oh what? Anyways, that's Saint Tail. Uh, so there's a lot of ports on. Apparently, this is a prototype. I didn't even know this existed. So let's let's try this prototype. This might actually. It's Frogger! Remember Frogger? Apparently there was another Frogger they were trying to do. That's a weird Frogger. Oh, he has a tongue! Once. Oh, two frogs! This is ambitious! How is the one of the prototype froggers? One of the better froggers, I don't understand. Oh god. Yeah, this is colorful and like very like like an eh. Oh that car's like so slow. Yeah, this is... Okay, where do I want? Riddle? Can I get three? Nah, just two. Well, this is a long frogger. Oh wait, yeah, I can jump on these islands, I... from here.
Also, this is a interesting melody as it's not the normal. <laughs> Oh, okay, yeah, I had to go back. Okay, it's one of those. Oh, we got snakes already? And we got the crocodiles. God. Oops. Oh, frog! <laughs> Give me the fly! Frogger, eat it! Lick the snake! Oh. Very punishing on... Well... That is... Yeah, it's it's a little weird. It doesn't Wait, tanks? Where the f where the hell is this? <laughs> I don't remember tanks of Frogger. Yeah, it's like Kuropi, except like off-model Kuropi. Maybe that's why this didn't come out, is like Sanrio was like, hey, that's a little... You're getting a little close there. Don't make a sick Hello Kitty. Did Frogger visit the tournament? I always love Froggers. Yeah, you know, that part in Swampy's Revenge, it, uh... It really resonated with me. I'm, I, I'm happy I don't have to start from the first level. Yeah, like, Frogger seems to move half tiles. Which is kind of weird. And trust me, I've I've played a ton of Frogger games at this point. Although technically, I realized I I still need to do uh, the Game Boy Advance Froggers. Something tells me they're not going to be great, but you know. Like, here, I- it- it doesn't- Oh my- I guess I can't get up there. I don't- Get on my- I don't know, um... Also, I like how- Yeah, Froga. Frogosaur. Yeah, it... Okay. Okay, I got two. I just have one more. Man, how do I get... This is one way, so... Okay, through here. Can I eat that? Oh, I can. Frogger eats his veggies. Now suffer some meat. What's that? Cheese? I. Well, that's Frogger. <laughs> Very, uh... Oh, an ice cream cone. Uh... You have other... Yeah, 
forget what was some of the other Uh well The Frogger that never was So many choices Uh Well this got translated somehow Oh crap was this the game I messed up? I think it is Okay, I just need to put in my head that I I patched the wrong game. Oh wait, maybe Oh, I have to like shoot the worms over. I wonder if they just like got the like anime licenses. I don't like this. There's a lot of worms on my side. Oh crap. I feel like I'm on like the ropes a lot. This is not good. I I feel like this is a losing fight. It's Panic Ball. Yep, Panic Ball, just... <laughs> Maybe I should wait until... I fix this. As hilarious as this is. I mean, I, I guess I'm technically able to play it. I still lost, even though I'm a glitched cube. <laughs> Missing nose mini game collector. Oh, crap. Oh, it's one of these games. You have to alternate. So far, I'm seeing a lot of mini game collections. Of course, this is all with the anime game. See, there is a game I knew I accidentally, uh, patched. I guess this was the one. Am I beating her? I can't tell. Shooting toy hunt. It's balloon. Oh, is it bigger? Bigger. Uh, thank you for the follow, King Reploid. It's just the bigger, bigger, bigger. I keep losing. Bigger. Yeah, 
Yeah, Game Gear, they actually put voices, which is interesting. It's not, you know... It's kind of like that old arcade voicing. What the heck? The computer cheats. He can, he can move his cursor far faster than me. Oh man, your dad's beard does not look uh, good. I don't want to do toy hunt. Whoa. Also, this is a Shinshan game and I have not seen him shake his ass at me once. What is this? What are we doing here? Is this really- What the heck? Why is this- Sound panic. Mattel Electronics presents B-17 Balmer. Well, that's Shin Shan. Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's do a part. Uh, of a game. Uh, it's by Microsoft, I believe. Although this, I do not believe this is made by uh, Rare. This is made by a different dev. Is it Sega? Well, it's Battletoads. Look at that toad. Yeah, you can tell this is a different dev because this toad actually looks... What the hell is that? What the... I'm getting boxed! What am I fighting? Leg day? I mean, this is a cute frog. What the? was never a battle toads person I think that it's again perfectly fine if if you oh man it's still the sky again that face.
What's that? Pink dragon? My stick! Wait. I fell? <laughs> no, my <laughs> yeah, that's right. That that cat about. Oh God. Did I? <laughs> I hate how I can fall off the ledge. <laughs> but like, you know. Well, that's a toad. That's a battle swords game here. Yeah, I double checked, and yeah, this is a Japanese port. I'm I'm in the safe. Yeah, no, it uh it definitely is a Japanese dev that uh battle oh, it's game gear. Uh Sega Retro. Come on, Sega Retro. You're my only hope. Uh de developer arc system works. Well, <laughs> There you go. When is uh, Rash appearing <laughs> in Guilty Gear's try? Uh, okay, we did a port. Uh, let's. I'm curious about this just because I don't know how it's, this is gonna work. Takara. A rip yeah, you're right, that would make more sense. It's Fatal Fury Special. Though I don't know how it's gonna work on the Game Gear? King of Fighters. What do we got? We got geese. I mean, I guess I'll just be Terry. I at least know how to fight. Uh, let's do Mai. I guess I also know Mai a little, but... Buster Wolf! Vernon! Oh, wait. Yeah. Buster Wave! I can, at the very least, I can do a uh, bust away and that. So those inputs, you know, I, I can at least do special moves. I guess that is something. I mean, it's particularly great. I mean, it's okay. You definitely don't want to play. <laughs> King of fighters like this, and yeah, this is a very busy. Oh look, I I tossed my hat. They at least did. Oh, in that uh, uh nighttime now. Yeah, that's this seems totally fine. Obviously, this is not how the preferred way to play King of Fighters, but. It is functional. This is basically all you can ask for for something like this. And he throws his hat. What else? What else? Wubba wubba, I'm in a pink... I'm in the pink today, boy! <laughs> Wee! Yeah, these are extremely busy backgrounds. Like, whoa. Yeah, they, they were like, no, that's gonna stay in. Well, 
I don't think anything's gonna get better than that battle quote, so... <laughs> that is Fatal Fury... Uh... Special. Yeah, well, you know, this, this is a little blown up. Yeah, I did get that SNK, like, pocket uh, collection. Uh, uh, what, what to do next? It's treasure. Remember treasure? Uh, no, this is Gunstar Heroes. Although I do have Riststar here, of course. Is that you, M. Bison? I got M. Bison. I mean, it might be good on the game here. 1995's Gunstar Heroes. Uh, I'm not familiar enough to know what that all means. Definitely is having a little bit of trouble handling this much stuff. Balloon Bomber. Oh, look at that. Look, look at that. Yeah, but no. It, it is. A, it's an impressive port, even if once again you're, you'd be better served in other places. Also, it's weird to be shooting this much and there's no correlating sound to it. <laughs> the no. <laughs> Am I fighting Captain America? Oh, did I die? Interesting. Some of these ports are definitely interesting as far as like them. Oh, let's yeah. do. Uh, I played this before. And I liked it, but we'll play it again. This is cool. This is Pretty Soldier, Sailor Moon S, uh, based 
on uh, Sailor Moon S. Uh, we will play as Usaga. You can also do Chibi Usa mode. She does not use her gun. And this has a fan translation. And this is actually one of the better Sailor Moon games. Uh, it's a weird platformer, basically. Uh, all the enemies are the villain of the week from uh, the show. So you have, you know, the cat girl here. There's a way to throw my... I forget. What is... How do you... There's a way to throw the... Here. Yes, I thought there was. Oh god, the wheel! <laughs> yeah, there's the elephant girl. That's it. I was like, there's a way to throw the tiara, and I'll... I have to charge it up. I like how there's multiple tire enemies. And you can, you know, do stuff like this. You can skip sections. So, you know, there's at least a little variety in what you want to do. This might be something. Uh, you can play as Chibi Usa, and I think she can. Oh god. That was a heavy knockback. No, Chibi Usa doesn't have her gun. I. I still always love that fact when I mention that Chibi Utha has a gun and they're like, what? I think that Rose made me invincible briefly. Oh, interesting. Dang it. But yeah, but I think this is interesting. Uh, as I said, weirdly, Sailor Moon, most of her games are just like beat em ups or fighting games. Oop. But, uh, game over. Let me see, I forget, what were the mini games? Luna Pea Ball Picnic. Maybe it was a uh, fine tech scene. Oh right, the mini games on this are bad. Match by stopping the roulette wheel. Match the... Basically the other Sailor Senshi only appear in the mini game section. We get to play fun things like match with slots. Nope. Nope. Bingo. Bingo. 
Yeah, like, once again, not, not, the mini games, not super great. Yeah, a lot of <laughs> slots and roulettes, not fun. L let's uh, do a fortune tell. It'll tell you your fortune, press the start button. Today's date is... Wait, it won't let me change the nines. Okay, we'll just... We'll just say it is... Uh... Mm-hmm. Yep, that's dead. Wait. That's okay? Anyways, that's <laughs> the only word I don't know how to... Uh, 19... <laughs> 19... 39... Yeah, the 90s, you know, that's when history ended. Uh... Sega. So this is Sega's Jurassic Park game. Well, they tried. There's the island. Undefeatable, the calendar. Now that I think about it, yeah, I didn't play all the Jurassic Park games because there was a lot. There's a computer that helps contain the dinosaurs started to malfunction. Look at that dinosaur! Ah! Oh no, red. It's, it's become the virtual boy. Total of four damaged areas of the fence. Jurassic Park 3DO. <laughs> I mean, that is a game. I hope this is better than that. <laughs> Jurassic Park. As he dives into the car, he wonders... Are he a sort of visitor center paired on Velociraptor? Round one? Oh, what? Oh, okay. It's not how I expected the gameplay to be. It's like I have a light gun on the car? Oh. Oh, go to the action stage? Oh. Interesting. Oh. Hey, that's not fair. It that you disguised it under the waterfall. Uh, 
What is that? Okay, it doesn't look like they... I'm so scared of waterfalls now, because, like, I do not like how it's, like, hidden. Now this is just, like, reminding me of Castlevania with all these dinosaurs jumping out of the water. Also, did you see? The health is hidden by the water. The health bar goes underwater. Can I get up here? Definitely, uh, oh god. This is not a... I need that health really bad. Oh! Yeah, I mean, this does seem neat. So far, I, I can't say, like, the Game Gear, I've, I've played like an absolutely terrible Game Gear game yet. <laughs> Look at the teeny dino! Oh no, it came after me! <laughs> Let me try a different level. This is like lava land. That's not good. Oh, I hit the little dino. Yeah, I like the cute little car. Oh, I got, I got, I got extra health. Oh god! Is a boss battle? Come on! That's not good. It's gonna kill me. Yeah, I could see that, uh, the bears that, uh, Tom's. What is this? Tom scream. like, you know, a pretty competent game. Not what I would expect out of Jurassic Park on the Game Gear. <laughs> well, I'm glad. I'm, I'm glad I can make Brie laugh. That's... Oh god, the lava!
Gotta watch out for the magma soda. That is a long jump too. Wait, I'm walking on lava? Well, that was neat. Uh, definitely didn't expect that. Uh, what next? Uh, anybody want to give me a letter? I think I pretty much have every letter. At least some variation. Uh, I got P and I got a Z, so we'll do a P. I'll do a P, Z, and then Tom and Jerry. <laughs> Jerry. Uh, hey, it's a uh, pack attack. Oh, yeah. Wasn't this on a uh, CDI? As like one of the very, very few. Yeah, because remember the CDI version had uh, the weirdly horny fairy. It's like one of the very few Japanese, at least licensed game. I don't think it was a Japanese dev on that. Oh, it's Pack Attack. I'll keep... At some point, I'm gonna have to play a bunch of Pac-Man games. There are a lot. Not just traditional Pac-Man, but there's also, you know, the worlds, the... Yeah, okay. Yeah, because I remember because... Obviously, the CDI does not have a lot of Japanese licenses. Look, if anybody wants to play Pac-Man Fever with me, I will gladly which is the uh, Mario Party style clone featuring Heihachi from Tekken, uh, Astroth from Soul Calibur, which I don't know why out of all of the Soul Calibur characters you picked Astroth, but... Uh, okay. But yeah. That's, uh, wait, why did I just move? Oh, that's not good. Uh, anyways, enough pack attack. Let's do the Z. Uh, something called Zan gear. Wolf team. Oh, it's Wolf team. 1990. Oh no, is this something where I... Oh... Yeah, this... I don't think this is gonna work. Also, the graphics in this not super great, <laughs> but... Yeah, this is one of those warring states... type of things. Okay. Oh, and it also crashed the emulator. Great. The emulator is super big. Uh, uh, as per requested, I guess we'll just move on to Tom and Jerry. Uh, how many people have seen the Tom and Jerry movie, which is weird?
happen. Yeah, the Tom and Jerry movie was like that weird era where they also did like a Felix movie. Uh, not to be confused with the recent Tom and Jerry movie, which I will say is worse than this Tom and Jerry movie. We've got to have money. Oh, yeah. The, if you've never seen the Felix movie, it is such a. What the? Does this have like Prince of Persia controls? And by that, I mean original Prince of Persia, not a. Uh, not any of the modern interpretations. Oh god! <laughs> oh, is that not actually climbable? The actual digitized. Uh, I. I. Ow! <laughs> yeah, I don't know if they'll actually do the. So what's funny is that Tom scream you typically hear is a uh, part of a cartoon sound pack. Trying. How do I like grab something? Thank you for the raid, Skeleton. Skeleton. We are currently playing uh, Tom and Jerry the movie. The game. For the Game Gear. I mean, it's actually alright. That, that's messed up. Oh. I, I don't think I'm gonna get far in this. Hoisted by my bad skills. That was Tom and Jerry. Uh, it's only 20 minutes long. That's, uh, that's pretty good. Uh, what would be good? I'm curious about this. I want to see how Outrun is on this. It's Outrun. Uh, what do we want? What song? Magical Sound Shower, Passing Breeze, or Splash Wave? Oh yeah, there's a lot of Sims uh, games on the Game Gear when I was uh, going through. Uh, I guess let's do magical.
Well, it's kinda outrun, obviously. Can't be as, uh... Visually... Oh, that's a nice little ocean there. I got, uh, the Sega Ages version of OutRun on, uh, the Switch. <laughs> There's the jams. Hey, Moo, where? Yes, yes, I, <laughs> I do have the game to quench your thirst. Oh God, that actually had the Sega. Hey, do you like Coca-Cola? <laughs> Hello, I'm Sakuro. Is Sakuro turned around? Oh, it's you. <gasps> hit, hit her with the POW gas! You're coming with me! K Koki! <laughs> I don't think you should name yourself Koki! <laughs> Surgeon. Enjoy Coca Cola. Drink Coca Cola. This kid looks like. Like his character design kind of reminds me of early Pokemon. I mean, yes, Coke is, you know, obviously in its DNA, but yeah, you probably shouldn't have named it Coke. Yeah. Oh god. Oh. That's pretty good. Oh god! I just went- <gasps> Skateboard! No! <laughs> oh no! The skateboard's one weakness! Stairs! Oh god. Can I get another skateboard, please? Oh no! Yeah, no, this game is cool, you know, for a thing meant to sell Coca-Cola's <laughs> rest in peace, Koki. Once again, those stairs! I know what to do. So who are the people after me? Is it, like, Pepsi? 
It's PepsiCo after me. Are they sending pet <laughs> the Pepsi Man assassin? The Pepsi Man says, sorry kid, it's nothing personal. <laughs> Radical. I I don't know, can I mean Pepsi Man probably could, right? <laughs> What's that? this? No, but I did get a free can of coke. Oh, wait, he can wall jump? That changes some things. I, I, once you get schmooving, it's pretty good. <laughs> Drink coke, become ninja. Wait! This is not the- that's the guy! Wait, he can do a Hadouken? Or what is- Oh, I just- I just kicked him. Isn't here. Try looking in the park. Wait, what? <laughs> I beat him up, though! Uh, continue life up. Coke disc? I want, I want coke disc. Grassy area? Oh no! There's nothing you can't do without a little coke in your life, right? Oh god! Yeah, this is pretty good. Uh... I assume the reason this never came out here is just because, you know, branding, they didn't want to put it over here. I mean, obviously, he would have changed his name to not be Koki, I would hope. Oh, I got, I got a slide. <laughs> Winners don't do drugs. <laughs> Except Koki. <gasps> oh crap. Oh. Yeah, that's true. Well, you know, different companies, different responses to certain companies might not care to have their game. Koki from. Uh, I believe, I think there's a... Oh, man. 
for a second I was like, is that... I thought that was in the background and for a second I was like, is that the Twin Towers with Coke? But, uh... That appears to just be a Coke goal. Anyways, this is pretty... pretty good. This is like a feature where Coca-Cola took over everything. If anything, this, this kid is the villain because Coca-Cola won the Soda Wars. Mistake. I didn't want that. Uh, I don't know. Let's look at a bro prototype of something. Uh, I. Oh, that's. That's not. Yeah. Uh, or maybe not. What do I have? Oh, yeah, this. I think this is a prototype, yeah. This is probably not Japanese, but I don't care. It's Yogi Bear. Speaking of, I watched that first episode of Jellystone. That was that was actually good. I enjoyed that. Yogi Bear in Yogi Bear's Gold Rush. Yogi Bear? Why does... What? Oh, I can switch between Yogi and Boo Boo. Wait. <laughs> That's just the one-up mushroom! Except I'm stepping on it. Is there any, like, benefit? Maybe this didn't come out because Nintendo saw that and I was like, hey... Come on, now. What is that? What are those? What are they, cat dog? Beans and jelly stuff. Wait, wait, it comes back up? It's... Uh, <laughs> uh huh. Well, it is a prototype. <laughs> and that's Yogi Bear, the prototype game that never came out. Let's do some Bubble Bobble. It's Bubble Bobble. By our friends at Taito. Now's the beginning of a fantastic story. Let's make the journey to the Cave of Monsters. Good luck. Nope. Can I just say one of my favorite Sprite things is when when these dinosaurs like burp up a bubble. It's like just this weird Muppet face. It's the game that <laughs> there are a lot of puzzle bubbles, and this appears to be a perfectly fine puzzle bubble. Obviously, stemming more from old arcade than anything like modern, but... 
If you like the puzzle bobble, it sure does bubble and bobble. I hate, you know, I think more robots should turn into fruit. That's my stance. Wait, coffee! I need to get some. <laughs> oh, crap. But yeah! Once again, perfectly... Alright. It, it does what you need to do... For your puzzle bobbling needs. Okay, there's this is just called Dunk Kids, and so I have no idea what this is. Japan Street Basketball. Let's just do a free play. Okay, I got Hawaii, Tokyo. Saka, China, Russia, Europe. Oh, let's share, let's, uh, Hawaii versus Europe, the famous match. Play. Wait, he stole the ball! Wait. Oh god. Nice. He dunked. Nice. Oh right, I only did one point! <laughs> well that was... <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get better than that. You know what, that's not fair. Let's... Let's do real boss hook up all. And you know... Uh, you know what is real basketball? Uh, something that just, for some reason, they're going to make a movie again? Uh, you, correct, you guessed correct, Wife City. What is this era? So it must be Slam Dunk. One of the plethora of slam dunk games. There are quite a bit of them. And I always like, they always say from TV animation. Yeah, the, the early One Piece games also have from TV animation. Okay, how do I... Oh, oh, what? That's how you do it? Uh... Weird. <laughs> I like the center screen. I like how you have to do a mini game. the ball. Can I, shoot. Oh, no. Yeah, I mean, Slam Dunk really was, like, super popular, so. Am I doing it? 
I, no, that was, that's the, well, it's slam dunk. I'm bad at this. It's an interesting idea, I guess. I like this stilled picture of the people drinking. Well. I know this can only be good things because it has the name Berlin on it. Conoco. Okay. Uh... What am I supposed to do with you, penguins? Oh. Am I supposed to kill these penguins? Part of the Berlin. <laughs> I just. I just turn that penguin into. Yeah, penguins very famous for tearing down the wall. It's like that, that uh, clip from Cyborg 009 where the penguin has a gun. Oh, okay, I can fall down with uh, immunity. Oh, okay, is that why it... Oh, oh crap, he can build faster than I can hammer. Well, game over. Uh, I'll see how this plays. Apparently this is a game to help you get a driver's license in Japan. <laughs> so... At least that's what it said in the description. I... Oh, yep. It is. <laughs> It's, it's asking me questions about rules of the road, I guess. Well, that wasn't, I, I had a feeling that was probably uh, not something that could actually be played. Uh, let's see. You could Just kidding. Uh, I don't know. Let's do head buster. Hey, buster. Nineteen ninety one headbuster. I think I have some Disney. Oh, is this an RPG? Or is this a robot building game? Oh. Yeah, this will be impossible for uh Okay, we can look at some Disney.
Well, here's a port of some of those Mickey Mouse games. Uh, famous for his iron grip on the world. Everything... Uh, one day, Mickey fell asleep. Are you on this one? Gosh, it sure seems creepy around here. An evil phantom stole the magic crystal that protected everything. The village? Crystal gone, the good magic in this valley has disappeared. In its place, bad magic has changed everything now. Rather than being a place of happiness, Yes, an evil phantom who lives in the castle, in the clouds. A good princess in the mountains can tell you the best way to get in there. Swell! I'll do my best! Yeah, this is a Kingdom Hearts prequel. Mickey. Can I like butt bounce? Yep. Birds hate Mickey. are falling in the web. Is that a tornado? I just thought of a... I just thought of a bad thing, which is like <laughs> list of video game characters who break things with their butt or kill things with their butt. <laughs> Apparently Mickey's on that list. <laughs> Pancake. <laughs> I do have. Oh, wait, what? What's that? I did get the sound clip from that Grinch game of the narrator talking about how the Grinch loves to crush things with his robust behind. I wonder, I wonder what was the thing, what is the progenitor of butt crushing? Wait, no, that, you, you know what I mean. In video games, I should state. What the?
That didn't work. Also, I can only get hit twice? I'm guessing I need to throw that apple into the snake's mouth? Yeah, wasn't it because of that, like, rental policy or something, you, you didn't want people to get through your game? Uh... So I'm, I'm gonna guess I throw the apple in there? I mean, why else are you gonna provide this apple? There we go. See? Give a snake an apple and it won't eat ya. He loves to swim. Well, <laughs> yeah, there's a few Donald Ducks. Uh, let's see, did that. I'm just okay. I'm curious what the heck is Fred Couples Golf? Sega like Sports presents. Oh, it's probably not going to be Fred Flintstone Golf. I'm guessing Fred Couples is a person. And not a cartoon. <laughs> Goal. That's what you say in golf, right? Red couples, yeah, that must. I know, I know that's not what it means, but stroke play is a bad term, IMO. Man, it, does, it doesn't even tell you who these players are. Like, I don't know who one white guy is from the other. Oh, man. I can change the color, though. a lot of setup rolling over gently sloping terrain ice <laughs> cold if only good luck give it your all Whoa, that's weird. Okay. <laughs> Look at this lady's face. It it has the energy of like some somebody telling some somebody to smile. Like you know, with like in a bad way. Like you should smile more.
Yeah, it's not great either. No nothing about the face is really... This will do better. <laughs> Jack Nick, <laughs> did you see uh, they announced a Jack Nicholson Nendroid from Batman? The the you know original Tim Burton Batman. Yeah. Uh, one second, now I have to, have to at least uh, link that, one second. Where is it? Okay. There you go, there's a uh, good smile announcing their, their pre-orders for Jack Nicholson. It actually is a pretty all right Nendroid. Oh man, right into sand. Looks like you. Come on, I'm getting it in that hole. So close. Oh god, what was that? Strong oat. <laughs> Something messing up with the emulation. There we go. I officially did a hole. That was a tough hole. Don't get discouraged. Hole out. I hate when I hole out. Uh, yeah. What is, I'm sorry. This prototype, this European prototype is just called Crazy Faces. Oh no. That, that's not good. I don't like this. <laughs> There's a lot I don't like. What? What? Uh... Oh. What? Uh... Oh... Okay, this is a puzzle game, but... So that goes all the way. Yeah, at least it gives you like a map of what to do. It's just weird. Let go. Actually, that will be pretty good. Does this go here? Yeah. This, uh, this is the European prototype of the... Anyways, this is weird. I don't like the faces.
I do not like the faces in Crazy Faces. Uh... Oops. Accidentally kick this. Uh, I guess we'll play some Baku Baku if it's anything like normal Baku Baku. There they are, doing the pog face. Wait, practice is a pig, normal is this, and hard is a sexy... I can't tell if it's a monkey nurse or just a nurse. How lucky, my opponent is only a little girl, hump. How rude. I'll show you who's the weak one. Yeah, I don't... I don't know if I like this green guy. Well, it's Baku Baku. So, as you can see, you need the proper animal for each thing, so... In a way, it's kind of similar to Pack Attack, if anything. Yeah, I believe I played the Saturn. Yeah, eat a bunch, rabbit. Yeah, it's like they digitize the... the other sprites. What's going on with his face? I... Oh. Oh, that was bad. They're BBs. Oh. Well. I can't... Oh, that's the password. Hi, honey. I'm very sorry, but... You are going to lose. Not me, how about... What the hell is that? I just realized I'm the girl and that... I'm versing this shitty drawl. Well, that's Baku Baku, it's a nightmare. to take it personally I was destined to win all oh, right this is the game over uh the liquid metal one was the second one uh, the third was the Lady Terminator, though. That's Baku Baku Animal. Uh, still nightmarish. I oh, mean, I had I I forgot I got a lot of prototypes. Uh, I think it's time. I think it's time for some heady. What do you think? It's a uh, dynamite heady.
It's the same. Eddie has come from the country to visit his friends. On arriving, he discovers that the town has been taken over by evil dark demons. <laughs> The evil dark demon is here. The gateway. Oh no. It's like a pre-rendered dynamite heady. The dynamite heady can shoot his head off. I guess in a similar way to Rayman, except he doesn't need any charge up. And it's his head, so it's weird. Also, that icon just makes him look like a turtle. Essentials. Toys and the hood. So here's a real level instead of... I don't think that's how I was supposed to do that. down to like I do like how uh what uh I get the Z and then fell asleep, I guess. Why not jump up? <laughs> oh, that's dynamite, Hetty. I saw one that I'm curious about. A well, little space harrier. I'm. Sh I assume the definitive version. But that's. What happens to the elephant? He's become a cyborg. This is kind of... Oh... Gonna say... Not that... <laughs> uh -uh. 
Welcome to the Fantasy Zone. Get ready. Get ready. I like how it looks like he has a smiley face on his side. I mean, I don't know if this is good, but it tries. Da, 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 da. What's that? Oh, these things. We got Space Harrier at home. Space Harrier at home. <laughs> yeah, part of the problem is these big bullets, like, when there's so many on screen, it's kind of hard to gauge when further oh god i wanted to at least get to the boss if there is one okay do we get to the boss at least what is this gonna look like oh god this is in oh no Oh man, Ugh. that's not good. They tried at least, I guess. This is just very hard to read. Let's space Harrier. Uh. Uh, let's play let's play a little uh, Magic Knight Ray Earth. Making so this is the second game making of the Magic Knight. Return. The Magic Knights are once again summoned. Uh, technically, my first stream was of the new Sakura Wars. I played all the way through that. And then my first retro stream would have been Utena. And then afterwards, I played through uh, uh, Ray Earth. Magic Knights, do you see Sirfo with a pillar on it? Also, other worlds are planning to invade. Autozam? Uh, okay, Autozam. Chizetta. Baron. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, is that the big Zam? You must train hard. That's why my pupil will help you. His name is... Oh. Is there any English? Guess not. My best pupil! Exclamation mark. There is Hikaru, hi. Oh look, look how cute Hikaru is. You must be smart, Umi. Hi there. And finally Fu. Welcome, sir. Bring them well. You have 50 Serfo days to improve. So... 
Uh, this is a fan translation, that's why. <sighs> I will teach you everything you need to know. I pay close attention. So I believe this is like a weird... Allows you to pick one of the three girls as your main student. This is the parameter. So I believe this is a weird game in the vein of Princess Maker. Here you can use items. This is the most crucial. <sighs> Schedule tra Yeah, exactly like. From combat, magic, art, dance, study, pray. Adventure and na <laughs> nap. Uh, my favorite activity, nap. Uh, girls, it's time to train. Nap time. Okay, right now. I mean, she's fine being main, I guess. Let's schedule a nap. <laughs> Here are my results. It <laughs> yep. Remember, everyone, that's definitely what happens when you nap. You get a strength up by 16 energy ups. You, you lose some charm, but you get that strength up. I did my best. <laughs> like, I did my best. I napped really good. Who cares about charm? Train? Yeah, let's. <laughs> Bedhead. So, yeah, very similar to Princess Maker in that regard. I don't understand what you're building up towards. Did my best. Strength down. This builds up to. But yeah, this is a weird, like, clearly inspired by some uh, Princess Maker type of game. Go. Oh, are you gonna lay something on us? Have you been training the will? Yes, I made them. I made them nap. That's a magic knight ray earth. Uh, Ooh, let's try this. Super space invaders. This isn't good.
This would be better if you just did the original. Uh, maybe that's why this sucks. <laughs> See, I've also thought about doing a bunch of Space Invaders, but I, I wonder how much I could tolerate just playing Space Invaders for <laughs> that long. Even though I know some of those games are not, like, strictly like this. Well, there's this game. That is not good. <laughs> this I'm curious about. Uh, it's, it's tempo, and at least for the Saturn, tempo is, like, extremely beautiful. So this is Tempo Jr. the major minor so oh wow I mean definitely looks good It's weird to go from that Space Invaders game and then to this. Do a dash. Obviously, not as many frames of animation as like original tempo, but this is still pretty, pretty impressive. What? This is, uh, good. I mean, it's Tempo. They made a junior version of Tempo. And at least in this version, it doesn't have somebody peeing a whole lake. Which is something that happens in Tempo. Caught there. I'm not sure what having a full sound meter does. Oh, that's what it does. I danced. Right? It's tempo. Obviously. Reduced tempo, but... Hmm. Okay. Let's try whatever Buster fight is. Buster fight. I like S UFO, got it? Mm hmm. Hayate? We got Hayate Gon Gonzalez. 
Hi Voltman, which sounds like a Metal Gear character. Wing. Uh. Let's be High Voltman. Oh, it's a mirror match. Dang it. <laughs> charge move that's not being very great oh what what was that Kill me already. Oh, that was only one round. I can't do another round of that. It's, it's no good. Uh, something called kinetic connection. Can I connect? This is just one of these. Well, that name sounded better than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Dang it. Well, let's let's just let's just use some face ball. I know what this is. Oh no. I mean, I guess this is kind of impressive for the game gear. <laughs> also, this is not. I f forgot I still had this on here, but. Sure, let's play some Faceball. Anybody remember Faceball? Turkey. 
I mean, they tried, I guess. The Game Gear's premier first FPS. Wait, is it chasing me? Oh, that's the problem. Well, that's Facefall. It's Dawson. Uh... I don't know, w wanna do another pro prototype? The demo of Dr. Franken? Oh. Oh. Uh, huh. The dragon head's cool and I... <laughs> I like the idea of, like, Frankenstein's just hanging out here with a rat and a dragon. <laughs> There he is. I I do not believe I can actually be killed. And I can shoot electricity. Look at those hands rubbing that book. Well, <laughs> that prototype. Not much going on there. Uh, did that prototype, so let's get rid of that. Dragon Crystal, we did Face Wall. Something called Foreman for real, and I do not know what that is. <laughs> oh, this is a claim. That means this is not a game I should have. Wait, oh, it's George Foreman. That's right. Yep. And I guess I'd be George. F Man, this has a huge roster. What the hell? Oh, well, let's be George Foreman. Hates that guy. It's a re regal rumble. I want to go to a real life boxing match and all the opponents just make this weird game woo sound. Oh, this seems fun. And that's George Foreman. Exciting. Uh... Here's another prototype. Something called Off the Wall? Now is this breakout? Get the ball into the... Okay, it's kind of breakout. It's breakout in a square and you have to get the ball into an exit.
Oh. Not much going on here. Interesting from a prototype, but nothing too much happening there. Uh, well, we did another special. By the way, S and K must have. Or I guess this is Takara right now. Or Takara putting out SNK stuff. It's uh Mark of the Wolves, Garu Densetsu. Two King of Fighters again. Is it the same selection? Oh wait, it is! I was like, wait a second. <laughs> they, this selection looks almost the same. Yes, you... <laughs> You are all right. Uh, I accidentally have the same game. Yeah, that I was gonna get confused with Garo Bog in the Wolves. Uh, you know, to make up for that, here's something I know is not the same game. At least I hope it's not. Samurai fear fears nothing. Struggles. A triumph over evil and lives for one purpose. To get money. Destroy. It's Samurai Showdown. Hey. Okay. All the warriors are not. Seems to be having a little bit more. And have a hundred percent pal. What? How can this not be doing Sam Show ju justice? <laughs> what do you mean it doesn't live up to fighting game standards? This is Mega Man, but I don't think it's actually Mega Man. Is it? Oh, maybe it is. Developed by Freestyle.
Mega Man has d oh, there's only four? Stone Man. Ugh. These sounds are not great. I do not like the blaster sound. It sounds like something being jiggled in a can. Mr. Floppy. Oh. Uh, oh, ow. Ow. Stop hurting me. I don't remember them turning into tiny ones. Is that new? Yeah, I wasn't sure if this uh, was a Japanese game because it didn't look like it had a... a Mega Man 5 NAS. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, the... So my, the first Mega Man game I ever played was actually Mega Man and Bass, so... My perspective on where Mega Man is, and then after that, I just play Battle Network. Uh, I didn't play X games at the time because they were too hard. I mean, I guess it's Mega Man on a portable. Even if it's. Oh, uh, yeah, I can charge my Buster. Wait, what? Ugh. Blah. That's a blood Mega Man. Uh, Mega Ma Ma Man, you gotta, you gotta attack Dr. Wowie. Oh, that's the Yeah, I've never been... Okay, maybe we'll end on this just because I want to know what the hell Panzer Dra Dragoon Mini is? Oh, baby! Look at the baby! Look at that baby! Baby Dragoon! Four hundred k. You know, it's still cute. It, even even if it's a big baby. And what's funny is this game. At least the sprites seem to be doing much better than that space harrier port. Also seems to know you don't shove 10 billion sprites on the screen when your system can't really handle it. What are those? Oh, bu uh, bugs.
Yeah, that is true. If, if that was one of the early ones. We're gonna do a boss. Oh wow, we did the side! the lock on. It does seem like they couldn't render the missiles, so they just kind of instantly die. Yeah, I mean, obviously not nearly as impressive as actual Panzer Dragoon, but... Sam Rubble. Maybe we'll beat this boss. Seems lock-on does not work with the ships. Just gonna keep dumping. You know, oh, that was the whole stage. I didn't realize that. But yeah, I think, I think we did a good look at, uh, at Game Gear.